Uh, good afternoon and welcome to this blab, uh, which is to announce the release of Blog Booster. Now, if you've ever checked my Facebook profile, my uh, blog site profile, you see that I am interested in three things blabbing, blogging, and coding. Well, Blog Booster brings two of those together insofar as I've written a system to help you uh, boost your blog posts. Now, many of us write blog posts and we take great care in making sure that the wording is right, the title is right, and everything makes sense, and we've got beautiful photographs in there. Uh, and then we uh, decide that the blog is fine, and we send it out, and we then send out a tweet with it, and we might send out a tweet the following day. The other thing is that we forget about it. And not only do we forget about it, everybody else forgets about it. Now, there are automated systems available which uh, will allow you to obviously uh, promote your blogs uh, over a period and Tweet Jukebox comes to mind. You can do it through Hootsuite, through uh, Delay Tweets. But all that is manual. And the problem is that if you've got a uh, WordPress blog which has quite a few blogs on it, transfer those manually to a system would take a little bit of time. So the idea came to mind of actually writing a program to do that. And essentially, uh, Blog Booster is three simple and easy steps. On WordPress, you install a plugin, which will give you directions for. And I mean, install that plugin called FindMind. You can then export to Excel a list of your blogs. And that has the title and the date you posted it and a link uh, to the blog post itself. So you end up with an Excel spreadsheet. That Excel spreadsheet you import into Blog Booster and that puts it into a database. And that's step one. So take it from WordPress, bring it into Blog Booster. You're not keying anything in, you're just pressing buttons and we now have your blogs listed on the screen or in the alphabetic order. Step two, of all your blogs, some of them might be time sensitive. Uh, it's pointless reblogging something which is either Easter or Christmas based. And uh, the situation on that is that you have a manual selection of the blogs that you want to tweet. Now we've been running this two ways. Uh, Angelica has put all her uh, tweetable blogs into Blog Booster and has been promoting those. Um, and what I do, I run it slightly differently because there's no wrong way, there's just different ways. I take eight to 10 of my blogs every day and I tweak them out uh, and I just select them. So select from your blogs. And this morning I selected 10 from the 85 I've written so far. And I then pressed one button on Blog Booster. And it is now, as we're sat here blabbing, it's now posting them to Twitter. And when it posts them to Twitter, it uses the title from the blog. You can add on to that a hashtag. And it also takes any graphics that you've got attached to the blog and post those there. Um, so Blog Booster, export from WordPress, import into Blog Booster, select the blogs, and then press uh, Booster on. And that's simply it. Now, to help with that, I have uh, written uh, a blog. Uh, I'm just going to post to the link to the blog into the text here so that you can take a look at the blog. And on the blog, you will find also uh, a simple screenshot and a video. Don't look at that letter. Don't 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 go away now. Um, so <laughs> that blog, and we also have a set of instructions. Now, most importantly, if you want to uh, become involved in using it, then there's also a site where you can register. I'm just going to copy the registration in and you can register here. I wish I could spell. No, no. I wish Facebook notifications were off as well. You can register there um, for uh, a beta copy of the software and you can try and test it and there's a Facebook group which I'll post it later where you can uh, get help and assistance so as I'm on my own I'm going to ask myself some questions if you feel like joining in and asking questions of your own 
and please do so. And my first question is, uh, which systems does Blog Booster run on and what do I need? Right, okay, Blog Booster is Windows and Windows only. That's Windows 8, 9, 10. It'll even run on Vista if you still have Vista. So any flavor of Windows, uh, it doesn't run on a portable uh, tablet or a phone. It runs on Windows desktop. Question two. Um, and this is an important one. Uh, I'm not sure how this is going. Perhaps when I run this seminar again, uh, I will actually uh, get somebody to help me with the questions. Uh, question two, I'll take a look right now. We said that you don't need to do anything with your WordPress blog other than export it. And that's done by using a plugin and you install the plugin. And then whenever you want to uh, recall, um, Okay, I'm not accepting callers at the moment. I'm going to lock the seat. Um, and that makes my picture bigger. Um, but when you export, your blogs remain as they were. There is no changes to your blogs whatsoever. You can export, obviously, when you set up Blog Booster, and you can export when you write new blogs. Uh, but the blog text and blogs are not affected. All we're doing is reading the database that's uh, storing your WordPress blogs and exporting it to Excel. We're not touching the data at all. Uh, question three, which is related, uh, is, I've got to type it in here as well. Oh. Can I use my WordPress site as normal? Yes, you can. There are no changes at all. Uh, as far as uh, creating blogs, uh, uh, amending blogs, you can do that anytime. When you export your blogs again, any changes you've made will go along uh, with the export. There's no problem there. So just use your WordPress site exactly as you would normally. And that leads us to our next question. Um, I'm going to put forward some Q in this time. Okay, I'm going to slide down a bit as well. Um, does my PC need to be on to run Blog Booster? Well, the answer to that is yes, it does. Um, the basic thing is that uh, the Blog Booster program should be loaded and the boost option should be on and active. It'll run in the background after you shrink it and it won't affect anything else you're doing. Uh, but if your PC goes into sleep mode, then Blog Booster will stop. Uh, you can change the settings for sleep mode. Um, in order to get around that. Okay. So we've said that you actually export your blogs from your WordPress blog site and you import them into Blog Booster. Um, now, you can do that at the beginning, obviously, because you need to get set up, but you can also do it at any time that you wish uh, when you've written new blogs. Now, there are two ways of doing it. Um, if you uh, export all your blogs, they're imported into Blog Booster, and then the next time around, there may be five more. Blog Booster will only import those five more. Uh, the original ones will stay as they are. So no problem on that score. There is one proviso to that. Uh, when you write a blog, you give it a title which is meaningful at the time. It may well be that when you tweet out, you want to edit the text, or you can edit the text of any blog in Blog Booster at any time to uh, make it more meaningful when it is tweeted. Um, when it's imported again, uh, it will find it and it won't overwrite it. So uh, you maintain uh, the system now. And that answers my next question, which is can I edit the titles of my blogs? Um, yes, you can edit the titles at any point in time. So I've just done question six. Question seven. Um, okay, now one of the things that when you're doing uh, a tweet out is that you actually want to add hashtags. Now, you don't add those to your blog normally because it can annoy people uh, and stop them retweeting. 
the blog. So within Blog Booster, you can set up uh, one main hashtag, which uh, will accompany your blogs. And if you separate it with comments, then you can add uh, up to 30 characters worth of hashtags, which will go out on every tweet. Now, on the tweets I've been sending out today, uh, I've been hashtagging Blog Booster in there because uh, that's what I'm promoting at the moment. But the hashtag can be anything you want. It can be up to 20 characters long. Um, and it's added automatically to every single tweet. Now, okay, next question you have is, okay, that's, that's fine, but question eight, can I import blog lists from more than one website? Right, okay, you can only have a moment one Twitter account linked in. I'll come back to that in a moment. But you can import blogs from more than one website. If you're running more than one website, then you install the plugin on each of the WordPress sites, and that then allows you to export the Excel file that is created when you run the file mind export. You can import into Blog Booster. So you can import your own blogs. You can thank you, Barbara. You can import the blogs from other people. Um, all into that gives you one Twitter list. Now, if you think of it. Uh, if you're running uh, websites for clients, this could be very handy because in actual fact, you can uh, export their blog lists, import them into Blog Booster, and then tweet out on their behalf without actually doing anything. So Blog Booster promotes not only your website, but your friends or your clients' websites. And all you've done is export from uh, into Excel, uh, export into, into Excel and then import into Blog Booster. Choose the blogs and it can be your blogs and your friends' blogs. And good afternoon, Tim. It can be your blogs and your friends' blogs. You brought the list, the Excel list into Blog Booster. And that list then contains every blog that you've done, every blog that they've done, and you can select from there, okay? And as I said earlier, what I do is I select 10 blogs a day that I'm gonna promote. I put the booster on having connected to Twitter, and um, it will then send out 10 tweets a day. Um, interestingly, uh, if you've got more than one Twitter account, you can, in actual fact, log in to your blog booster with any of your Twitter accounts. So not only can you promote on your main Twitter account, you can promote on subsidiary accounts as well. The same set of blogs, the same post bank, uh, all from within the one blog booster list. Okay, now we get to the really interesting part. Okay, and I'm just getting hold of question nine. And right, okay, now I'm going to take the question. We've already said that you can import blogs from other people. Um, but what if, you, if you're not controlling their blog sites, you're not running their blog sites for them, and these are people who you want to help promote, um, you can uh, export your blogs from Postbank into an Excel file and send it to another blog booster user. So these are the 10 that you've decided on today. You send them the file, they can import it on, into their blog booster, and they can tweet out your blogs Mm -hmm. uh, during the course of the day. So that we've got people promoting other people. And this means two things. One, it's people helping people. And the second thing is that your Twitter feed will not be totally related to your own blog. It will be related to friends' blogs as well, so that you can help them uh, actively promote their blogs. Um, and the other side of that is um, a final question here from myself return and answer question can i import blog lists from other blog booster users to give variety to my twitter feed well i've partly answered that uh any person who's got blog boost can set up their post bank to sort of 10 tweets for the day and they can then send that list to another blog booster user to import um and at any point in time uh you can refresh that list as time goes on. So you're actually promoting yourself and you're promoting other people as well. Um, I'm also open to any ideas or suggestions as to how we can grow this. Now, it is based on Twitter. 
and we import our blogs from WordPress into Postbank and send them out via Twitter through any of our, our Twitter accounts. That's the logic behind the system. And uh, we know, Angelica and I know that it works. I know it works because I'm the designer. Uh, and Angelica knows it works because she's been using it on Angelica's German traditional translation for the last three months with a higher level of interaction and responses that wouldn't have got because Angelica has got uh, blogs are going back. Well, we all know, Barbara and I know that blogs go back way back uh, since uh, Angelica transferred to WordPress. And been, Angelica has been getting great interaction uh, on our old blog set because it's all relevant. Um, she doesn't post out the Christmas and Easter blogs. She posts out the Learn German blogs and they have been getting interaction. Uh, so it means that a blog post, a well-written blog post, which of course Angelica's are, uh, can be promoted uh, anytime. Um, so that's, that's a brilliant way of doing it. Now, if you are interested in uh, joining, then I put up the registration once again. Um, I just want it to appear at the end. That's the registration form. And I should mention this point because I've forgotten, totally forgotten. This version of Blog Booster is free. And that's whether you use it personally or you use it to help friends. Uh, and we know that it works, so you can download it and you can get to grips with it within about half an hour. It takes to set up properly uh, and to learn it. We have uh, online instructions. I know I've just been reading and answering 10 questions from those instructions. Um, so uh, if you are interested in promoting your WordPress blog posts, and this is WordPress blogs that you host yourself, then uh, Blog Booster is definitely a way to do it. We know that it works and we have tried and tested it uh, over the last two months and we're ready to go public. Hence the uh, blab today to explain what Blog Booster is all about. So now what I'm going to do uh, is just run through that quickly again. Um, and if anyone has questions or wants to come on air, uh, I shall unlock the seat to answer any questions. And Stephen, if you've got questions, you're welcome to come. Uh, Angelica, you're welcome to come too. Babs, um, I understand today, and I hope you get better soon. And I uh, look forward to blabbing uh, next Thursday at two o'clock when we will be discussing uh, using images in blog posts. Right, so from the top then, a quick pre of Blog Booster. Blog Booster is a Windows-based program that allows you to promote your blogs, existing blogs, on Twitter. You export your blogs from WordPress using a plugin, and you import the Excel file that, that creates into Blog Booster. That gives you a list of all your blogs you've ever written in alphabetic order. You can go through those blogs, marking the ones that are, you want to promote, uh, and you can either promote all of them or some of them, um, and then you switch the booster on, and whilst your PC is running, uh, it will send out one tweet at an interval you decide. My tweets go out every 45 minutes, Angelica's go out every 90 minutes. Uh, it's up to you to decide how frequently you tweet. Uh, it doesn't affect your normal tweeting, it's automatic, and it runs only when you want it to. So Angelica set her system uh, because she's kind to people. She doesn't tweet about business on Saturday or Sunday. So it's switched off for Saturday and Sunday, uh, whereas mine runs all week. Um, right, so there you have it. You've imported your blogs, you've marked them, you've set Blog Booster running in the background, and it carries on doing its thing. The next thing we talked about was the fact that uh, you can do it not just for yourself, but you can do it for any website for which you have to which you have access. For your clients' websites, you could export their blog lists, import them into Blog Booster, and you can then tweet out their blogs on your account. And you can use any of your Twitter accounts, your main Twitter account, or any secondary account can be used to tweet the blogs. You need to set it up once, uh, and it will run. The other thing you can do uh, when we get quite a few Blog Booster users is that you can send them your post bank, your list of 10 the blogs that you want promoting. They can import it into their system and they can blog out on your behalf. They can send you their list um, 
and vice versa. So in fact, essentially, everybody's promoting everybody else. Now, you can uh, clear the post bank at any time and decide on new content. You can import from your WordPress blog at any time and uh, promote your newest content. And the way that I tend to do it is to take three or four blogs that I've written in the last week and six or seven uh, from my back history going back to 2013, where the blog is still relevant. Uh, I mean, I have blogs writing about Google authorship. Uh, which has come and gone since I wrote the blog. So there's no point tweeting about that. Um, and likewise, several other posts as well. But what it means is that you can take your dormant blog and you can uh, position it so that you tweet out the blogs in, that you like, uh, want to promote, at any time that you want, the frequency you want. Now, note on that. If you're willing to leave your computer on overnight, blog booster will tweet whilst you're asleep and the people who see it whilst you're asleep will be the people in america and the people in australia so you have the potential with blog booster to reach a totally new audience with your uh, back catalog and as i said if you mixed up with your recent blogs as well then you're actually promoting your your blog site now uh for those of you who are still listening um blog booster works with WordPress and Twitter. It also works with YouTube and Twitter. If you have uh, a YouTube uh, page of your own, then there's a separate uh, routine we can run to export a list of all the videos that you have on YouTube. Now, the videos that you have on YouTube, it will export into an Excel spreadsheet. You read the Excel spreadsheet into Blog Booster, and that then gives a list of all the YouTube videos you've made. And on the same principles as before, you can choose uh, several or as many as you want of those YouTube videos to actually uh, go out onto Twitter. So that's uh, WordPress blog, it'll do. YouTube, it will do. We've tested it with both of those and there is no problem. Um, so you can promote, uh, again, you can promote your own or you can promote other people's YouTube uh, pages as well. So they could import their YouTube list and just set up um, the post bank with those uh, lists. And essentially they can then tweet out uh, their own uh, YouTubes and your YouTubes as well. Finally, uh, last feature, if you want to mix up the content that you're posting out, you can also add content from any source. If you go to manual, you can add uh, to your post bank tweets that you want to send out interspersed with tweets uh, from WordPress and YouTube. So you can type in the text of the tweet, you can type in a link into the tweet, you can uh, then add that to the post bank, and it will tweet out anything. Any web page can be tweeted out. Anything at all can be tweeted out within, within Postbank, Post Bank, but you set that up uh, manually. Where, thank you, uh, sign up. Wow, this is like a webinar. We've got sign ups, brilliant. Um, I'm, 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 it's very kind of you. Right, okay, uh, that's a reasonable question, Stephen. I, I'm gonna put my hand up at this stage and say that I am a, a SQL Server coder uh, and produce desktop systems and networking systems. If you know of anybody who's got their skills, then I would be more than willing to work with them uh, to actually create uh, an iOS app or an Android app uh, or, and something that will run on Apple. For the moment, it's Windows only, but with a specification, it could be made to run any system. So Windows, while we're testing, to make sure we get the bugs out of it. If this sounds familiar to any Blab users um, with the promised Android version, it is. Uh, we get the bugs out of the core system and then we spin it off into other operating systems. Now, uh, just because you're all here and you're all good friends, I can now tell you that not only will Blog Booster post to Twitter, but it will post to Facebook as well in the next version. You'll be able to take your post bank and you'll be able to post directly to Facebook, um, which means that your blogs 
can be posted onto your Facebook page or your Facebook business page. Um, and that's about a month away. At the moment, uh, we're taking registrations for Blog Booster uh, and we are take all your uh, thoughts about it and your experiences of using it. We want to make it as easy to use as possible. Remember, it's one, two, three. One, export from WordPress and import into Blog Booster. Two, mark the blogs that you want to promote on Twitter and soon on Facebook. And three, uh, switch the booster on. And that's totally under your control. And it's your data that's going out there. It's going out on your Twitter account. And uh, the thing to do is to test it with two or three blogs and uh, see how it performs. And then uh, whilst we're on, I don't think I've mentioned it yet. Um, there is, in fact, if you'd like to get involved, um, a Facebook group as well. Um, I'm just going to type that in here. Want to know more if you've got questions for anything I've said today, then uh, please, all of you, you're more than welcome to join the, uh, the Facebook group. Well, you'll find Babs and Angelica and I and several of our friends who have been looking at the system so far. Uh, so the support is there. Uh, you'll find example videos of setting up, of exporting, of importing, of the design, uh, uh, operation of it, and uh, also a full set of instructions as well. So we've got a full documentation there. Right, I'm open to, to any questions. Uh, if not, I shall uh, stop recording. Uh, it's been a pleasure. Oh, brilliant. Okay, thank you, Stephen. It's been brilliant to uh, to talk to you all, to talk about Blog Booster. This is the first time I have actually promoted it uh, outside uh, Angelica's and I's circle of friends. So uh, I'm glad that you found it of interest. And uh, I thank you for watching today. So I'm going to stop in a moment. Finally, run through Blog Booster, WordPress blogs, export into Excel using a plugin, import into Blog Booster, mark the ones that you want to post on Twitter, set it running, leave it. That's it. Blog Booster, one, two, three. Thank you for listening. I'm going to switch off recording now and